Water makes life possible, connecting people and countries. Over the past 20 years, countries in the European Union have used the groundbreaking Water Framework Directive to manage and protect rivers, lakes and groundwater, and in some cases, even return them to their natural state. In 2016, building on previously successful cooperation on strengthening water management along the EU's eastern border, the European Commission and six neighbouring countries launched the large-scale project European Union Water Initiative Plus EUWI Plus to collaborate towards best EU practices on stewardship of water resources, alignment with EU legislation and improvement of transboundary water management. While being very diverse in their landscapes and socio-economic realities, Armenia, Azerbaijan, Belarus, Georgia, Moldova and Ukraine face similar challenges in modernizing their inherited water management. European and international organizations such as the Environment Agency Austria, the International Office for Water in France, UNECE and the OECD have a vast experience on water management issues. Their support to this cooperation brings a focus on water protection, integrated with public health and economic development. They work hand in hand with the region's policymakers, water managers, academics, civil society organizations and the population at large to support the ambitious reform journey. Combining European experience and local knowledge, in only four years, partnering countries have updated their national water strategies, policies and laws, advanced the implementation of the multilateral environmental agreements, water convention and the protocol on water and health, developed modern management plans for 11 river basins, upgraded their technical water monitoring capacities, reviewed the use of economic instruments, improved cooperation within the countries, between sectors, within the region and with EU neighbours over shared waters, as well as strengthened public awareness and local participation on integrated water resource protection and use. All six countries now have high-performance analytical laboratories and can test the quality of their surface and groundwater to European-level standards. They have improved data collection and monitoring, allowing evidence-based decision-making on water use and protection issues. Furthermore, through publicly consulted river basin plans, water users can fairly share their limited local resources and be better prepared to adapt to climate change. More than 100 trained water professionals now use cutting-edge techniques for monitoring, analysis, planning and communication in their daily work. Countries have either updated or are in the process of adopting water legislations, which will enable water resource management regulations to be in accordance with the EU approaches and principles. Thanks to the European Union Water Initiative Plus, over 30 million people living in the region will benefit from this EU support. Not only will their waters be better protected and readily available for different uses, the people themselves will have an opportunity to plan and manage the future of their water resources. Now well versed in the benefits of adopting good water management practices and having embraced the human and technical capacity development exercises delivered under EUWI Plus, the six Eastern Partnership countries will continue application and scale-up of the lessons learnt and experience gained under EUWI Plus to further strengthen their water management. As the region aims to strengthen its economy, create job opportunities and improve environmental policies, the EU stands ready to support its Eastern partner neighbours in this next stage of implementation while delivering tangible benefits for citizens. Caring hands will tend the water that supports our lives.